Welcome to Common Man Cocktails. I am your host, Derek Schomer, and today we just, I wanted to make sure to get out before we do our recording for the day. It is Friday. I'm publishing this, producing this, and getting it out on the network as publishing all today before we tape for this week. And I wanted to get those, just cover up the contest winners for our Tito's Handmade American Vodka Boston Shaker. So I had one winner and then two runners up that will get our bottles of Peychaud's bitters. So I went through all the different uh, videos multiple times, many multiple times, the reason there's a couple of views on there. And the winner that I picked was with pretty much Doug and a lot of the different, uh, some of the fans had mentioned it, and even some of the con contestants. Uh, the winner was Straight Jack, the Straight Jack Cocktail by Joe, where um, it, the and the reason I kind of leaned towards this besides the public opinion was because, not just it, not just because he finished almost a, almost a, a full bottle of Jack Daniels in a, in a single sip, uh, that is interesting, and I'm gonna show you the video in a minute. Uh, but because of just the, the dry nature, the humor behind it in, in a kind of a, I don't know, just it, it, it just kind of, it was entertaining to watch on top of what the surprise factor was. The, the presentation was well done uh, in the personality. Second runner up, or no, first run, well, runner up, whatever. I put all my notes here because I forgot to bring a pen up. Uh, if I can remember my friggin' pen. So, runners up, I had the Spartacus Cocktail by Ken and the Lila Tequila by WWE Deadman. You, both you guys will get the, and I'm going to send these out to, I think, neither of you in the U.S., so I'll send these over to you, and hopefully they make it there. I don't see why they wouldn't. Um, so that you guys can have that. On top of it, all the other contestants, was it was a great, great to watch and see. We've got, we got the Noble Cocktail where... Um, he dressed up like like a nobleman with the with a whole attire. Uh, there's a couple people who didn't get to submit videos. Um, there's some people who have their own video channels, uh, so you know they've submitted some videos. So you get to kind of see them, and I'll link all the videos. Actually, they're already in a playlist. I'll just link the playlist down for all the contestants that entered. We'll do another one at some point when I get some new stuff. Those that didn't win, when I, I'll find something for you. I am working on the final tally for a 30 recipe cocktail book that I'm gonna have printed um, in the town over. And so maybe I can send some of those out to you guys so you can have a, a signed, printed uh, cocktail book for Common Man Cocktails, our top 30 picks. Anyway, until then, I'm going to show you just a little bit on... Well, actually, I'm going to show you the whole two-minute segment of the Straight Jack. Here we go. Hey, guys. How's it going? Welcome back to my channel. And today, we're going to be making a cocktail. Now, I drink a lot. I drink a lot. And I watch a lot of YouTube channels where they make mixed drinks and stuff like that. So, what I want to show you guys today is a drink that I made up myself. It's called a Straight Jack. And... It's kind of a play of words for like straight jacket, but it's a straight jack, and I'm going to show you guys how to make that. I kind of have my ingredients off to the side because I wasn't too sure the table here was big enough for all the ingredients. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to make that right now. And the glass we're going to be using today is the Stein, okay? So we're going to be using the Stein, and our main ingredient is going to be vanilla Coke. I've already opened this, so it's open. It's vanilla Coke. So what you're going to want to do is add about... About that much coke you know just enough to sit at the bottom and then you want to take your Jack Daniels now this is uh this isn't the main ingredient but it's called the straight Jack because it's mixed with so much stuff so what you're gonna want to do is go ahead and take your Jack Daniels and just kind of do that so you got your Jack Daniels and your vanilla coke and that's it that's all you got to do you know it's that simple don't mix it don't do anything like that and just smells like vanilla. So let's, let's go ahead and have a taste. Has a really strong uh, vanilla aftertaste. It 
you really smell that vanilla. I hope you guys enjoy this recipe. If you like, if you like this recipe, go ahead and leave a comment in the description below. And I'll see you all next video. And lastly, just we'll finalize and finish off with just a couple clips from the runners up. And uh, I didn't pull everybody's in here because pulling them off of YouTube is actually a pain in the butt. So hopefully everybody enjoyed it, had fun with it, and you got to see some of our other fans interact with your videos. Um, and if you guys haven't seen it, go out to our playlist on YouTube and check out all the different videos that came in. And ask yourself, why couldn't I have done that? All right. So congratulations for the gifts. I will get them out into the mail for you guys. That's it. I'll teach you how to drink. Hi everyone, welcome to the show. I'm Ken and I'm here to create the Spartacus cocktail inspired by the TV show. I believe it was on, yeah, it's on Stars, which I've only seen one season of. And, and I actually have a little write-up story for it, which I'll tell you along the way. The arrival of his wife is met with sorrow as the raspberry schnapps become one more obstacle for him to overcome. Once again, half an ounce. In dismay, Spartacus is, like Tito's, handcrafted to become the ultimate gladiator. This we're gonna be using one ounce of. It's a little sweet up front, but very quickly you're getting the, uh, the alcohol right here, but it's not like a harsh burn. Like you're getting more heat than anything. And then it's, I'm used to making some pretty lousy cocktails, but I mean, for me, I don't think this is half bad, but I mean, this is not a, a drink that you're going to be ordering. Just be like, okay, sip, sip, sip. I enjoy it. I enjoy it. I enjoy it. This is more like, you know, one that you're like, Whoa. Welcome to Come On My Cocktails. I'm your host, Derek Schomer, and I have no idea how I did grow that much hair in so little time. I don't have a third of an ounce on my jigger. Um, yeah, it's a German recipe. It uh, was more or less translated from, from CL. So then... Blue Curacao, we're using both because I'm all out of uh, uh, senior Curacao. We go through this stuff so quickly. This grenadine is really good. Uh, just get a zoom this in. This is really good. There's not that, it's less sweet than, than roses or something like that. Uh, since it's uh, not made with, with freaking... Uh, uh, high fructose corn syrup. I must get us in that. The Lila tequila. Prost. Nice tequila finish. Very sweet. I get a little bit of the, of the um, coconut. Good job. So, question of the day, um, do we have any, we don't have any question of the day? Also, did, did I say come on and cocktails, I meant Sunday Night Judas. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, I said it now. Anyway, um, yeah, everydaydrinkers.com, we're teaching how to drink.